Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Most forms are connected to an underlying table or query from which they display and or update their table data. In Form Design View, you can access the list of fields available to the form and simply drag and drop them onto your form to quickly add data controls to the form for data entry or display. To view the field list that is available for a form, just open the selected form in Design View and then click the Add Existing Fields button that appears in the Tools button group on the Design tab of the Form Design Tools contextual tab within the ribbon. Either way, this will show the field list in a pane at the right side of the Form Design view. If you have associated a data source with the form, then the available fields will be shown within the fields available for this view list. Now if there is no underlying data source associated with the form, then you can simply click the Show All Tables list, and then click the plus sign that appears next to the name of the table that you would like to associate with the form to view its fields within the field list. Then just click and drag the desired fields from the table into your form. When you do this, this also associates the selected table with your form. Now notice that when you add a field from the field list into your form, you're actually adding two controls at once. The control at the left side is a text label that displays the name of the data field. The control at the right side is the actual data field where the underlying data from the table will be displayed. In the next chapter, you will examine the ways that you can manipulate the form controls in more detail. It's also worth noting that while you can add controls using the field list, many more types of controls are available for use in the Controls button group that appears on the Design tab of the Form Design Tools contextual tab within the ribbon. You can use the buttons that appear within this group to add many types of form controls into your form in order to create a more advanced form design. You will also examine these controls in greater detail in the next chapter. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www dot teachucomp dot com forward slash free